Hello everyone, today's Hidden Indie Jam is gonna be a bit different. Usually I talk about games that I find really cool here in the channel, but for this one I think I might do a gameplay series. And showing the game is even better than talking about it, right? In my opinion, this game does a lot of things right, and it's really fun too. So let's check it out. And here we are. From the start, this level looks a lot like the first level from Mega Man X, but the game is actually pretty different. I mean, the movement is very similar. You can even double tap forward to dash. Oh, and by the way, you must activate it on the menu to enable this option. You should enable Command Run here, because it's deactivated by default. Another thing to activate is this Show Burst option. Leave it to short. I'll show you what it is for. You don't have an arm cannon in this game. Instead, you have lots of punches and kicks. You also have a dive kick and a grappling hook. When you hit enemies and they die, they will turn gray. But you can go even further and hit them until they're red. This is the overkill mechanic of the game. And just look how fluid movement is in this game. You can even grab ledges and slide down. When enemies are grey, you can use your hookshot to grab them. Keep holding the button to carry them around and when you release the button, you will throw them. The hookshot is very useful too. You can use it to hit enemies at a distance. What's really fun is using it to counter the enemy's attacks like this. Keeping up the chains of combos, grabs and throws is also very satisfying. Oops, oh, okay. Should have used the grappling hook. When you hit a checkpoint, you can press up to repair yourself. But that's gonna cost money. Each time you repair yourself, it's gonna cost you more. So it's a good idea that while you're playing, try to get as much money as you can. This mechanic is also very interesting, because if you manage to beat the level without healing yourself too much, 
you'll get more rewards in the end. I'll be quick with the dialogues, but you can pause the video if you want to read them. And at this point, you get your first special technique. You can see here that all slots has flying strike, because it's the only technique I have. But during the game, you'll get more techniques and chips that will improve your character in many ways. One thing that I didn't like a lot is that when sliding, you must keep pressing the button or else the character will stop in the middle of the dash. I mean, slide. Come on, I can't die here. Okay, a lot of, I lost a lot of health at that part. can't die now, so let's be very careful, let's play it safe. Yeah, nice combo, see? That's what I'm talking about. Okay, checkpoint, I don't need you anymore. back I need more ammo it's really hard to play and talk at the same time now I know what why so many youtubers they they look like they suck but actually it's hard you have to concentrate in the game and also comment on what you're doing or else you're gonna lose the stage Also, you should be exploring in this game. I'm not exploring the level enough, so I may, lo I may be losing some secrets here. I'm full health, so I won't heal myself. And here we have our first boss. Every Mega Man boss has to be a giant robot of some sorts, and here is no different. And it's more hard here because you have to get really close to hit them, so what? You, you get hit a lot. So you really have to move close, attack, and move away. With my special, I can finish this. Okay, 
And that's it! This was the intro stage of Gravity Circuit. Since it was the intro stage, it was pretty easy. But in the next videos, we're gonna fight the real bosses. So I believe that you'll see me dying a lot in the next episodes. I definitely recommend picking up this game. It is very fun, especially if you are a fan of the Mega Man series. Let's check this final dialogue before finishing the video. And that's it. Make sure to watch all of the other videos from the Indie Hidden Gem series too. As always, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.